yeah hello everybody and uh, welcome back and hope you guys are doing well and we'll be continuing with our previous class and in the previous class we have done a master detail form uh, from our template and today we'll be doing uh, another last template uh, on the form so let's go and start right click on the form and we will be going and doing today a uh, detail uh, detail form a uh, transaction okay so detail form transaction is like when you create a sales order or purchase order right so we are going to use this kind of uh, for this kind of transaction like creating a sales order purchase order we'll be using uh, this uh, form transaction detail form transaction so let's open it uh, and rename it A product transaction detail uh, from template leave it as none uh, but for now we don't have a uh, uh, any at least we need a two form for a uh, two tables to create uh, this uh, uh, transaction detail one should be a header and one should be a line like a sales header will contain a customer detail and right and the order detail and the order line will contain the item uh, item detail right so uh we don't have uh, any two table right now and we're just uh doing a simple one and adding our uh existing table which is a product table we have only one table but later stage uh, when we uh, add a more table may maybe we can come back and uh, add it on here so let's go and add our data source first which will be our product table and just go to design and go to tab on a tab page detail we have a two one is header info one is a detail tab let's go to detail tab and first we will go on to a line view and on the page tab we have a line view header and line view go to here we have a grid view all right so in this grid i will be adding my column uh, i want to add all of my column first okay so i will drag and drop to my grid okay and uh, let's save all and open it okay sorry i forgot to add a data source for a grid view uh where is the data source data source here the product yeah and save it and open okay now we have a uh, form and this is a line view and we can also go to the header view we haven't added anything on the line view uh, what add line and remove line so if we add line for our uh, new sales order then we can add product active and barcode like okay and the price let me give us a pen and create a date and time uh today and okay so i will copy this date and just paste it over here and uh next time maybe we can uh auto fill this uh column right so we don't have to key in the created date every time we add in that will be on the coding part of course an item id just give a, a random item id name and i will give as a uh, name as a uh, let me give a name as a milk sorry milk and on stock let me change this to on stock right so if you see our if you close this one and if you go to 
product well, synchronization if you open it here we will have a new product already added a milk so that form is uh, usually wa uh, working so we have added here this is like we adding our sales line like right? each, each order may contain a multiple line so this is a similar with uh, that one and we will be adding a header part so grid part is okay now and on the header part which is here okay header part and let us add a few detail mm, like mm, few detail let me add a this this yeah okay so I think this should be enough okay we have a header part now but we haven't given any name so that's why it's uh, not showing anything so uh, our header part is over here Jason is header or uh, we call as order detail okay so save it and uh, open the form again so we have order detail and order detail we have added a created time and created time created it so this is how we use uh, this template which is a transaction detail uh, template uh, usually is used in uh, if you all open a sales order or a new purchase order you can uh, you'll find this form okay so uh, our line view is uh, okay and we have to add our header view right so we have a two view over here one is a header view and one is a line view so we can switch between header and a line and our line is looks uh, okay fine and uh, now we'll be adding a header view side right so go back here and let's find our header view yeah, this should be our head of view okay head of view detail and uh, the tab header general uh, we don't have anything uh, let's uh, drag our field over here mm, let me drag uh, two i two field uh, first is item id and item name over here right and let's save it and we'll open the form again Okay, on the header view we have a on the general tab we have a item ID and item name, right? And on the line view we have a, our order detail. So well, let's just add another another tab over here, and uh, this is our header tab, and let's add another tab page. And move it down. Mm, we add as a caption, give us a price, and we'll drag our barcode and price tag to mm, this tab page. Okay, this is our header head of view and. Uh, you see the column is an auto and we also have to make this as a column is one but uh, we'll make this as a auto right column switches to auto which means it will auto adjust the tab and just uh, save it and open it In the header view okay now we have a price tab right and just add one more tab for let's add one more last tab page just to show you okay, 
Okay, so this I uh, will be adding as a caption I created as a date, and I will add my three date field over here, and I will save it and open it. Hit the view. We have a date, but now you see we have a one column right for date is three row and one column. So we have to switch back it to. It's okay if you want to keep it, but uh, uh, if you want to change back to auto, then we can change the column to auto, right? It should be auto, and just save it and open it. Now head of view, and now you can see we have a auto column. Right, so um, I think guys, uh, this much for this video. We have learned how to add our line view and we also learned how to add our header view. And on the next classes, uh, we'll be doing much more and we'll be designing uh, more detail on uh, the form and coming and designing, adding some more designing to form when we have a more table and things will go on. And thank you and thank you for watching.